What's up, y'all? It's your boy Double J here, back with another video, and I am back in the shop again this week. The same exact issue, man. That I've been, I just spent over four thousand dollars for. I'm having the same issue, and I'm gonna flip the camera around. This is my issue, man. I don't know what's going on, like. I just started yesterday. It started last night. Um, it came on last night. And for some reason, it happens right after I get deaf. Like, I was on two two bars on my deaf. And I um, put some fuel in that Fly J and... Um, I don't know which one it is. But um, at Fly J and... About 100 miles up the road, probably about 150, 200 miles from the Flying J. Um, it started doing that. My check engine light came on and it started flashing and direct me down to 55, um, 25%, and I can only go 55 miles an hour. But I pulled over last night and I um, cut the truck off and I hooked my my tool up to it and um, reset it, the light, and it went away. So then I drove like, um, I had, I was like 15 miles away from the Petro, Rafi in Virginia, Petro. So I went there and parked for the night. Um, I didn't run the truck at all that night, um, last night. And I woke up this morning and it still wasn't on. It still wasn't flashing. So I went, got on the road and started to see, um, see down the road. I got about a hundred miles up the road and it started flashing again. And then it derated me down. So last night it didn't derate. But today it derated down to 25% and I can only go 55 miles an hour. So I made it here to the um, to the Excel here in um, Roanoke, Virginia. I had to drive 30, 30 miles, well actually 59 miles, doing 55 miles an hour, man. But um, I was doing do that versus getting towed again and paying that tow bill again. So I'm here and they say they can um, possibly get me in after lunch. So it's um, one o'clock now. So hopefully they'll be coming to get me soon. But um, let me turn the truck off a little bit. Coming to get me soon, and I can they can see what's going on, and I can get up out of here, man. Cause I'm headed to Texas. Got to be in Texas um, in two days, and I'm still what fifteen hundred miles away. So I have to do some serious riding tonight and tomorrow to get to Texas. But if I can get out of here by this evening, get me some rest, and then I'm a, um, I can do it in two days. I'm pretty sure I can do it in two days. There'll be a lot of riding and let that door close, but. I can do 700 miles a day, so I can do that and get there. But hopefully I won't have to do that and I can get out of here, man. It's Jesus Christ. I am tired of this truck. Not tired of my truck. I'm just tired of this death issue, man. I was thinking about deleting that death all, all, all together, man. You know, I don't go to Cali no more, so I don't have to worry about that. And, um... I'm just thinking about taking that death off, man. Cause it's, other than that, my truck works perfect, man. So I'm, I'm just thinking about getting my death deleted and not dealing with this no more, man. Cause this is, this shit is made to keep you in the shop, man. I'm, I'm, I'm convinced this shit is made to keep you in the shop. It doesn't, it doesn't serve. I mean, I don't, I don't know the purpose that it serves to, to protect the ecosystem, but what, up, what the fuck ever. But, you know, I can't keep being in the shop anymore. Like I said, I just spent over $4,000 last week. Got my truck out of the shop last... Shit, it, today's been a week. I got out last Tuesday. Today has been a full week. I got out today. Around the same time, man. And it had me down for a week last time. I hope that I, it, it can just get me out of the shop today, man. 
But I will update y'all and let y'all know what's going on, man. Once they tell me what's the problem, man. Like I said, the last time they put a death awning on, um, kid on my, my truck saying that that would prevent this from happening. And now I'm back in the shop again. So I don't, I don't know what's going on, man. So We're going to see. So I'll let y'all know what's going on after the, I get out of the shop, man. Peace out.